What's up everybody, Andy Mills here and I'm back with some more Animal Crossing tips and tricks. Alright, I have a very short video for you, but um, in my one of my previous videos I talked about setting up the museum and after I believe one day or two days, I believe it's just one day, so one day of setting up the tent and then the next day happens, whichever way you do it, by time traveling or just by letting time progress naturally. Uh, Lathers will actually pop up and he's gonna tell you about uh, what he needs to set up a museum Well, he is about to give me a certain DIY project and It is if you guessed it by now It's basically the the vaulting pole to go over the river, which is huge So all you have to do if you want to get the vaulting pole is you have to uh, acquire the museum and then wait a day to get blathers and then talk to him. That's all you have to do. All you have to do is just talk to him. See, as you saw, he just gave me the DIY. And he's going to ask you to give you get fossils for him. <clears throat> and he also sends you the schematic for a shovel. So, that's another uh, that's another great thing. So, that's perfect. Let's go see if... So, I must acquire more items to exhibit 15 more to be precise. Right, so you also, if you want to open the full, the full museum, because it's just like a tent for him, you have to get 15 items. Uh, I believe fossils is what he's specifically talking about. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so let's open our phone. Let's go to DIYs. Yep, so he gave us the flimsy shovel and the vaulting pole, which is huge because I already had the, the shovel, the normal shovel. And yeah. So there you go, flimsy shovel, and you get the vaulting pole from Blathers as soon as he opens up his tent. And you just talk to him, you don't have to do anything else. There you go. If you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like. If you're new to the channel, hit a subscription. I'm going to make more videos as I see them, put it out there so people can find them. I hope you guys are enjoying the video and the content. I stream on Twitch at .tv slash Andy Mills if you want to follow me there. Um, that's where I do most of my live streaming. Uh, if you have any suggestions, please let me know. If you have any questions, I do read all my comments. And that's pretty much it. Have a good night, guys.